I look like absolute garbage today, but I already packed my makeup for our trip. So this is what everyone is going to have to deal with. Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing something a little different uh, besides my uh, hauls and my subscription things and all of that. But I am probably going to try to pre-film today so you will probably see the same environment, the same look that I have going on in a video or two. But that will be okay. So today you can see right here in the background. I took all my memorabilia boxes out from the garage because when we moved in here, we didn't really organize them. I kind of just threw them in boxes. And I have things to add that I've been finding here and there, and I do want to add some rhythm and rhyme to how they are put away and put in storage and things like that. So we are going to go through them. So I'm going to start with the first box, and this one is barely full at all. It just has like a little small layer of stuff like on the bottom of the box. So it has plenty of room to add more things. So backstory before I show you this item. Every summer, my friends and I would take a staycation at a hotel. And this one time we stayed it at the Golden Nugget. Or yeah, I think it was the Golden Nugget. And we were walking the strip and the Chippendales were out taking free pictures with people. So that's what we did. So there is me, and then this is our group of friends. So that's that. <laughs> I totally forgot about this. That's so funny though. So I think I'm going to kind of try to make piles, like my school stuff, and then like other stuff. <laughs> so this is another trip photo. Uh, what year is this? It doesn't say what year it is, but I am pretty small. The little one is me, and then that's my cousin. That is at San Diego Zoo, and I have not been there in forever or SeaWorld because those animals need to be let out. So this was a Christmas present, I want to say. It has gotten a little dirty from all the moves, but this was a Christmas present from my friend Caitlin. She is an artist, and she knows that my favorite Disney princess is the Little Mermaid. And right now, she's actually doing a college program in Disney World in Florida. But I think hers is coming up, like, the end of it's coming up this week or next week, and then she's going to be going to Disneyland in California, I think. Don't quote me on that, but that's pretty cool, and I'm really proud of her because I know that's something she's wanted to do for a very long time. Here's another interesting one. The little trophy and it says Bailey Baxter outstanding achievement in reading and what year was this that's weird that it doesn't say the year or anything interesting but I got this because I think I was a fourth say I was like in second grade and I had like a sixth grade reading level or something like that so I got this little trophy and I got this book from my grandma it was made by someone in our family and I'm very into like the artsy photograph type stuff so she gave it to me it is very fragile and delicate but it is beautiful and there's so many cool things in here it's beautiful in this box I also have an iPod touch and it's the old one where it takes the giant charger and I don't have those anymore but I'm gonna keep it to see if I can get into it one day and see what I have on there so this is something that I just kind of put together yesterday this is it right here see there's still a lot left in there but I have this strange thing with keeping cards like birthday cards Christmas cards um, graduation cards letters and things like that so I put them all in here so they weren't just everywhere and I'm sure I'm going to find more later on. But I think the first few pages I wanted to originally make this like a page count for my first book. But that didn't go as planned. So like the first page I have a little note that says I love you bae on a Panda Express receipt. 
that my friend Sarah Berg left on my car windshield one day after school that I found. Um, I have letters from friends. This is from Gage. This is from when he was in basic training. Sam Collins, the YouTuber. There's a couple from him and our friends Natasha and Leslie. Cause we were pretty close. We used to send each other letters all the time. You can see Sam G, Natasha. But I like keeping this kind, this type of stuff. Like here's a card. This is the baby shower invite for um, Thea's baby shower or Riley's baby shower for Thea. Graduation cards. I have thank you cards. I like keeping this type of stuff. It just, it, this stuff means a lot to me. Like, I have a lot of sentimental value for things, so I wanted to save those. So they're in this little thing, and I'm going to keep this out for when I find more, because I know I have so many more somewhere. Okay, scrapbook. This is from my junior, senior year, I believe. And this is what it looks like. It's pretty full too. Hold on, what is in Arctic Lights? I think this is when Sam what Sam did a show here. Yeah, this is from when Sam Sam Collins did a show here, and he asked me to come see him. So that is the wristband that I got the VIP thing, so I could go hang out with him and talk to him and stuff. But yeah, like this is a scrapbook from junior senior year. And there's all kinds of things with like prom, just friends in general, stuff for my mom, graduation. It was a very fun time. I love this thing so much. And there's just no room at all. Like even some of this stuff is from after high school. Like this page right here is kind of crazy out there. But this is mine and Logan's first trip to Disneyland which was after we got out of high school, obviously, because we weren't together in high school. So here's the page from when we flew Sam out here to see us. I have a video from when he was here on my other account that I might put on this one and kind of make a video, like bring it back since it has been, I think, four years since he's been here. Oh, and then there's, I met Sean and Austin Mahone twice. So that is that page. So now we have yearbooks. I have so many of them. Like this is 2005, 2006, uh, 2007, 2008. I have, this is like elementary school. Yeah, this is all elementary school elementary school but I went to two different ones so I have two yearbooks for each elementary school that I went to this is middle school middle school and then I have two for high school so this is 2013 I believe this was my freshman year yeah this was my freshman year and my sophomore or junior year. I know I didn't get one for senior year because I completely spaced and I'm so upset about it. Okay, so now we're getting into one of the more interesting boxes. First, here's my cap, or this is my gown. This is my gown from graduation. Here is my cap with my little tassel. That's all messed up. I actually got two tassels, so I have one on my cap and then I have one on my rear view mirror of my car so there's that and here are my on reports so one of them is for advanced diploma and one of them is for just honors cord I honestly don't remember which is which but these are my cords <laughs> this is a wristband for the neon museum I went with Logan's parents our Lost Rages band from this year. Midsummer Night's Dream. I got this from my grandma and this has always been from, oh, this is from 2001. I got this book in 2001, but this has always been pretty much my favorite book that anyone has ever given me. So I keep it in my keepsakes. This is another book that I keep in my 
keepsakes from my grandma. It's a little tooth fairy book. And this is what I put my teeth in when I was little. And I put this pouch under my pillow. It just pops right out. And then it has like a little tooth fairy book with it. One of my favorite things is this. This is from, I want to say, Sheila Tar, which is the elementary school. And I got a superstar of the month, which means like every, they pick a student every month to be the superstar. And you can bring your pictures in and make a little book of like your family and things like that. See, and there's, this is how old Spaz is. She's still going, she's 18. But, and then in the back, everyone writes you letters. So, like, all of these are letters from all of my classmates. Like, all of them wrote one. So, I thought that was pretty cool, and that's something that I keep. This is from my senior photo shoot. Here is one of my favorite memorabilia things. Um, quite a few years ago, I went to... California with my mom and they had the Tim Burton exhibit there and if you know me I love Tim Burton I love him and at the end they have like a little gift shop and this is a book of Tim Burton's illustrations and this is the back I painted her and I have it in like the protective sheet for binders and then the tickets are inside as well. But if you go through this, it's like all his drawings and um, like why he drew them and stuff like that. Okay, so here is where we get into our concert stuff. I have two VIP meet and greet passes for Austin Mahone. And then I have the two Shawn Mendes meet and greet passes. Um, the second time I went to go meet Shawn, he actually remembered me from the Vegas show, which was the first time that I met him. And he was like, oh, yeah, I remember you. You're from Vegas. And I was like, yeah, that's me. And I felt so special. Okay, this is an assignment that my friend that painted a little aerial thing wrote in her English class junior year. And every morning, um, me, her, and a couple of our other friends would go to our friend's our friend Cameron's house and we'd stay there and then go walk to school together and then we went to Cameron's house after school as well and she wrote this piece about Cameron's house and I got goosebumps I love that so much so I hang on to it we I think we all asked her to make us a copy of it and we hung on to it so clearly I'm gonna have to make this into parts so this is gonna be part one I will probably put part two up tomorrow or something like that but pre-filming. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the little bell if you ever want to be notified when I do post a video, and I will see you guys next time.